Whether it's a wedding, prom, or a red carpet event, I'm going to show you my head-to-toe pampering tips for the night before your next big event. Before entering the shower, use a dry brush, like this one from The Body Shop. Dry brushing exfoliates the skin and increases circulation to help detoxify and reduce water retention. Upon entering the shower, I like to start with a body scrub. So to smooth the skin and prep for the self tanning that I'll be doing later in this video, I use this sugar scrub from The Hut. It smells absolutely amazing. It's tropical mango and I love it so much that I actually have to remind myself not to take a spoon and eat it. Now, you don't have to do this next step, but I like to use a foot scrub for my feet, which is generally much more abrasive than a body scrub, and this really helps with dry, calloused feet. All right, so now it's time to remove hair. Now, you can wax if you'd like, but I'm going to shave my legs with a shave cream to prevent any nicks or cuts. The shave cream acts as a cushion to prevent that, and you definitely don't want that before a big event. A Perfect World Body Cleanser by Origins gets me squeaky clean and it is my current favorite body wash. Next is face and hair prep. So tonight I'm going to be using two different face masks and I highly recommend using masks that you know will not cause irritation, so masks that you've used before. I chose my favorite detoxifying mask which is Glam Glow. Now while I wait for my mud mask to dry, I'm going to do my signature hair treatment which you've seen before on my channel most likely. I'm mixing a cocktail of coconut oil and Josie Marin Argon Oil. Now this is going to stay in my hair overnight and it's going to be washed out in the morning. The biggest bummer ever before a big event is to get a giant zit, and sure enough, I did, so I'm using the blue light which neutralizes acne bacteria and aids in reducing swelling. Now I'm using a second face mask which is going to be hydrating and plumping to the skin, so I'm using the Origins Overnight Face Mask. Now it's time for some body treatments. In preparation for summer, I've been using an at-home laser hair removal device, which I use every other week, and I will keep you updated on the results because I just started using it, and no, it doesn't hurt too bad. Next, I'm going to be doing self-tanning. Now, you ask, is this too much? No, not for a big event. Obviously, you have to look your best, so make sure that you are diligent with how you rub this in, otherwise, you will look like an orange zebra. And this particular one by Tarte is really nice because it has a brown undertone, so you look tan and not orange. Now I'm going to be using a foot cream and this also prevents from getting the self tanner kind of stuck in between your toes which sometimes happens. So I'm using gel lined socks with foot cream and then I'm using Origins Make a Difference hand cream with gel lined gloves and putting the hand cream on and putting those gloves on and now it's time for bed. All right, well that completes this head to toe pampering video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope that you remember to take the time to pamper yourself before your next big event. Also, keep your eyes peeled for my next getting ready video for the QVC pre-Oscar red carpet event. Until then, XOXO, wait a second, I think I've been watching too much Gossip Girl.